Hey, what's up, everybody? Pop Culture Junkie back again, and we are checking out Gamer Block, and we have our special guest again. Say hello to Jordan. Woo. How you doing? I'm doing good. Cool. And you still got Gamer Block and the uh, M for Mature one, right? Mm-hmm. Cool, cool. Yeah, the Rated M Block is something by Nerd Block, and it, they have two variants of it. They have the Rated E and Rated M Block, and I get the M Block every month. I've really enjoyed it so far. Sweet. Okay, so uh, let's go ahead and crack it open. I know you don't ever look at spoilers, so we have no idea what's going, what's yeah, in here. I have no idea what's All in right, here. All right, cool. So let's crack it open. So, all right. First thing you got right here is the Blizzard Cute and Deadly. I always really like these, and the last time I got Diablo, I down a whole lot. Yeah, I can't remember. I got one of these in some other subscription box, and it was like a weird beak-looking creature. I don't know what it was, it was yeah. on the back. Oh. Uh, no, nah, it might be an older, might be an old series. This is series two, that's why. Yeah. Okay. I got cool. one from the old series. Okay. Cool. Let's crack it open and okay. see what we got. Cool. I'm not even familiar with this, like the the universe. Yeah, the uh, series. I've I've got one figure from another box like a year ago. In another case, I got some magnets. Yeah. yeah. I have no idea who this is. <laughs> this is... It just says Barbarian. Okay. I imagine it's from Heroes of the Storm. It's from their, um, their MOBA that they have. It looks pretty I, awesome. I think. It kind of reminds me of uh, Tim Curry from Legend. Yeah. With the giant horns. Yeah. I can see that. <laughs> <laughs> cool. Well, cool. Okay. So we Barbarian. Awesome. We got the t-shirt. All right. Oh, sweet. Okay. All right. So this this is the King of Iron Fist tournament. This is actually a Tekken T-shirt. Uh huh. And I'm a huge fan of the Tekken series. Okay, that's got to be because they just came out with Tekken Pops too. Yeah. That's got to be. I've got yeah. about four of the Tekken Pops so far. Nice. I've got almost every Tekken that's not on PlayStation because I have an Xbox. Uh huh. And I've already pre-ordered Tekken Seven. I'm super excited <laughs> for it. <laughs> So, familiar with Tekken, yes. Oh, yeah. <laughs> this is awesome. Sweet. That's a cool shirt. Good. Next, it looks like we got another game. This one is Camp Sunshine. Oh, nice. Kind of looks like a... Friday it's like 13th. another horror game. Kind of like we kinda, got last month. Yeah, it kind of looks like Friday the 13th with the, the front there. Like, sleepaway, you know, sleepaway camp, uh, Camp Crystal Lake, whatnot, yeah. Yeah. The, yep. uh, I thought that was a machete at first. <laughs> oh, it looks like it's just a little knife. Yeah. But yeah, it's cool. Looks pretty cool. Nice. This like That's Steam, cool. I'm guessing again, or I'm guessing. Yeah. And we got okay. Halo New Blood. So reading material. Yeah. Awesome. Which I know when I was a kid, I read all the Halo books. So oh, this okay. might actually be pretty good. Cool. Hmm. I'm excited for that. Yeah. yeah. I never got into Halo. Yeah, I, I I tried playing it. I tried playing it on the old Xbox, and I tried playing it on the 360 when uh, Halo 4 came out. That had like a big announcement going. Mm -hmm. But I never got into Halo. I like shooting games. But I just never got into Halo. I fell out of <coughs> it after Halo 4 because that was just a real disappointment of a game for me. That's probably why I didn't really get into it. <laughs> what was that? Nice. Uh, okay. okay. So we got a Vault 111 sticker from Fallout 4. That's going on your car in about two oh, seconds. Yeah. Yeah, I've got way too many stickers on my car, and this is definitely going to be a welcome addition, because I absolutely love the Fallout series. Yeah. Yeah. Nice. This yeah, nice. I'm, still anxious to, I'm still anxious to play Fallout 4. I'm, yeah. I've done about 5% of Fallout 3 in a year. Yeah, it's super fun. Yeah. And I think with this, we've got the best thing is... Oh. oh. That's yes. awesome. Let's see if I can bring this a little bit closer to see. This is a Metroid print. Yeah. That, that is, is amazing. Yeah, it is. <laughs> yeah, that's going oh. up on the wall. That is a that <laughs> Mother Brain, Seamus, man, that looks awesome. Oh, that's yeah. That makes me so happy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I'd frame that up in a second, right? Yeah. Oh hell yeah. That's that's so cool looking. It looks like it's pencil drawn too. Yeah. That's amazing. I was looking to see if there's like an artist on here anywhere. It doesn't have his his or her name yeah, on there. It's got nothing. Yeah. Yeah, that's 
that's, that's really, awesome. really good. <laughs> I, and I don't even care that it's not in color. It's awesome. It looks more badass in the uh, in the black and white. Mm -hmm. Okay, and we got here the booklet. So we've got the Cupid Deadly Blizzard Blind Box, uh -huh. the Fallout 11, or sorry, 111 decal, mm -hmm. Halo New Blood novel, the Metroid art print, Cap Sunshine, and the King of Iron Fist tournament t-shirt. Sweet. Yeah, I, I'm in love with that t-shirt, just because yeah. I'm a huge fan of the series. Right. And this print, and the vinyl that's that's going up in my room today <laughs> and on my car in like the next five minutes right no this is a really good this is a really good box you got yeah. re good reading material awesome print sticker you got the blind box which those are always at least like six to ten dollars depending on where you shop yeah and then downloadable games these vary like you know between 10 to 15 bucks sometimes and the yeah. shirts alone those are i mean if you buy these at a convention you're paying like what 20 25 dollars at least yeah yeah and as far as the games go i'm excited that they're actually putting games in every box that i've gotten so far yeah that's really smart of them to do that too if they're going to be a game block you know gamer block then put the games in there yeah you know? even if it's not cartridge stuff it needs to be something like this yeah really yeah, cool. this is nice is it, like it have you had any other art prints before uh i haven't gotten any art prints from these guys before yeah. i know i did from previous blocks that they've given me but yeah. not from the rated m block yet yeah that's a really good ad addition yeah, it's so cool. I'm I love this box so far. Yeah, I'm <laughs> impressed. the the last The one we did together last month was really good with the uh, the VR and everything. Uh, but this is impressive. The art print, shirt, and the game figure and decal, and even the book. Even though I'm not a big Halo fan, for Halo fans, I know they'd be going crazy to have a book. Mm -hmm. So Can you give me something to read. So how would you rate this box on a like one out of ten? One out of ten. I give this box a good eight. Cool. Mainly for the T-shirt, the print, mm -hmm. and this. Everything else, it's mm -hmm. good. I'm super excited for if I, this. If I had gotten this, like, you know, again, this is Jordan's box. This is, you know, my, I don't subscribe to this. This is Jordan's box that we're unboxing here. If I if I subscribed, I'd be so hyped over this print. Oh, hell yeah. The shirt <laughs> and the game and the figures. Even though I'm not a fan uh, because I don't really follow Blizzard, I don't know anything about these, the figures just look awesome, and I'm a big Mystery Mini collector as most y'all know so yeah yeah i like the figure it's really really good detail i mm -hmm. definitely like these as compared to some of the other figures i've gotten in boxes mm -hmm. i kind of wish i got an overwatch character but this is still really cool mm -hmm. yeah. sweet okay cool yeah well hey cool box and uh i know you're gonna be getting next month's oh yeah without definitely. a doubt right <laughs> yeah they, right. they've hooked me the sweet. last two boxes well cool anything else you want to add to the unboxing uh, no, I think I'm good. Okay. I think, I think we covered everything. Yeah, cool. sure I'm happy. Everything. Cool everything, yeah. All right, well, uh, hey, everyone out there watching, I hope you enjoyed the unboxing. And uh, we'll leave some comments below. Let us know what you thought about the box and everything you see here. And if you want to leave some comments, we'll always get back to you, of course. Uh, make sure if you haven't done so already, click that subscribe button so you can check out all my other unboxings. And as always, you can always follow along with me on Twitter, Facebook, and Instagram. Well, hey, Jordan, thanks for coming back yeah, another month. Good to be and here. We're going we're gonna to definitely do another one of these uh, as you get them. Oh, yeah. So, uh, all right, everyone. Well, until next time, this is the Pop Culture Junkie. And Jordan. I'm signing out. I'll see you later. <laughs>